Wise Latina Network. Gives you a feeling of power. power. Hi, I'm Cynthia. And I'm Sandra. And together we are the Two Wise Latinas. Tonight we're at the Conga Room in beautiful downtown Los Angeles. Join us. Gives you a feeling of power. power. Okay, we are here at the Wise Latina Network with Josefina Lopez of Real Women Have Curves. Thank you for coming tonight. Well, it's so exciting that you're doing this. It's, it's you know, it's about time that something like this happens. So I commend you for doing the. Thank the, you. Coming from the original trailblazer of Latino women. That's what right. are you up to now? Because you've got a lot of really interesting titles. Tell me. Well, I'm working. I wrote Real Women Have Curves, the movie, and I'm also working on the musical version because right. we should be in Broadway as well, you know. And uh, I recently produced my first feature called Detain in the Desert, which is a protest to SB 1070 and the anti-immigrant laws in Arizona. And Brilliant. You know, yeah, and then uh, I have a theater. I'm the artistic director of a theater. So I'm, I'm teaching and trying to empower Latinas to become writers because we need more representation. You know, most of the this images we see on television are, are those of eroticized Latinas or, or Latinas who are servants. Right. So it's That's kind right. of the role that we're given, and I think when you see a room full of executive, powerful Latinas, Latinas in positions that are, you know, that are really are contributing to society, I just think it's so unfair, and so, so I've decided to start producing movies to change that. Nice. And tell me about the article you have. The well, I'm actually, it's so great. You know, I think when Sotomayor got, became the Supreme Court Justice, it really made us believe that anything is possible. That's so right. I think the idea of us being wise Latinas really just spoke to me and I decided to start a column called Ask a Wise Latina. How because, appropriate. Yeah, so I have a column that's been going on for three years, so when I found out about your network, I was thinking, oh my goodness, there's so many she wise Latinas. She fit right in. She just fit in. That's right. That's right. So just a question. Um, why do you think we don't have more uh, Latins or Latinas specifically in film and TV today? Well. You know, we have more than we did a couple of years ago. True. But the, the sad part is that the Latinas that we have seen, the ones that have been successful, they mostly play the hot señorita. Right. And, and so, so it's not a question of getting more Latinos if we're going to be playing stereotypes. It's a question of getting quality characters. But really the main reason is that, you know, I've been in the business for over 20 years. And the thing they tell you is that they're not commercial, which is right. kind of ridiculous because there's so many Latinos in the U.S. now. The market is just like it's, it's just there. It's exploding. But the excuse is that it's not commercial because it's about women and it's about Latinos, and so so that's really it. It comes down to money because nobody wants to put three ten million dollars on you know on Latinos unless they're 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 going to get money back. You know yeah. what's amazing is when Jer Jenny Rivera passed away, she had just signed to do a TV show on uh, primetime, and then of course she unfortunately died in a plane crash, <laughs> and I feel like it left this gaping hole for the Latino yeah. women to step up and well, actually fill so. it. I think we, we must demand our proper, right. you know, it's like, it's never given to you. You have to demand it, just right. the same way she said, it's, we, we can't ask for permission to be leaders. A leader doesn't ask for permission. A leader right. sees the hole and says, you know what? There's something missing and we and have keeps to seize the going. moment. Seize That's it and keeps going. Yes. Thank you, Josefina Lopez, for coming out tonight. The original trailblazer of the, the wise Latinas. Have curves. And the <laughs> That's right. real women have curves. Thank you. Gives you a feeling of power. power.